Hi guys, welcome back to Besame. My name is Sherlyn Smith and today I will be reading you a story called A Man, His Son and the Donkey. A Man, His Son and the Donkey Once upon a time there was a man and his son who were driving a donkey to market. They were going to sell it. As they walked along the road, they passed some people. The people looked at them in surprise. Isn't that strange? The people said. Those two are walking when they have a big donkey they could ride. The man and his son heard them, and they decided that it was really a good idea to ride. So the man told his son to get on the donkey. They went along for a little while. The boy was riding on the donkey and the man was walking beside them. Then they passed some more people. These people also looked at them in surprise. Just look at that boy riding while his poor old father has to walk, they called out. What a foolish man to walk while his son rides. The man and his son heard this. So they decided that the father would ride and the son walk. They went along like this for a little while. Then they passed some other people. The people looked at them. What a terrible man! He is riding while his poor little son has to walk, they called out. The man and his son did not know what to do. Finally, they decided that both of them should ride the donkey together. They were riding along like this for some time when they passed more people. The people were amazed when they saw them. Just look at that. Two big men riding a poor little donkey, they called out. What terrible men those are. So the man and his son got off the donkey. They wondered what to do next. Finally, they decided that there was only one thing left to do. They decided that they would both carry the donkey. When the man and his son reached the market, everybody stopped what they were doing to look at them. They had never seen two men carrying a donkey before. The people were amazed. Then they began to laugh. They shouted for other people to come and look. They made so much noise that they frightened the donkey. The poor animal kicked up his legs and fell to the ground. In his fright, he quickly got up and ran. He ran right into a river and drowned. The man and his son realized how foolish they had been. They looked at each other sadly. We have learned a very important thing, said the father. You cannot please everybody, and if you try... You will not even please yourself. The end. Yes, that is a very important lesson to learn. You cannot please everybody. It's better just to please yourself, honestly. Anyway, let me know what your thoughts are about this story. If you liked it, please remember to click the thumbs up button and share it with your friends. Until next time. Bye-bye.